On 30th January, BJP's Manoj Sonkar became a mayor of Chandigarh after defeating Congress AAP candidate Kuldeep Tita. He secured 16 of the 35 votes while Tita secured only 12 votes. Eight of them were declared in the, uh, invalid. Following the results, protests broke out against presiding authority Anil. Marshals were called into the house to control the situation. BJP's R Rajinder Kumar was elected as deputy mayor. The voting took place at the Municipal Corporation Building in Chandigarh. This is the first time the opposition India Alliance members fought any elections against the BJP. This is the first time AAP and Congress allied to defeat the BJP in any election. It's unclear how deep the impact would be on the alliance. Notably, AAP has already announced it will fight the Lok Sabha elections alone in Punjab, which was a major jolt for the India Alliance. The polling process took place in the presence of Chandigarh Municipal Corporation Deputy Commissioner Vinay Pratap Singh. The voting was scheduled for 10 a.m. However, it began, began an hour later as the Deputy Commissioner and BJP councillors were late. Ex officio member of the House and BJP MP Kiran Kher was also present in the House. She was the first to cast a vote. It took an hour for the voting to complete. Though the AAP Congress Alliance had 20 votes and BJP had 15 votes, excluding one from the ex officio member Kher, the Alliance failed as eight votes were declared invalid. This is the first time reporters were not allowed in the press gallery to cover the elections. They watched the process on the screen installed in the conference hall.